for the region. I, I would like to thank uh, to everyone who contributed to the construction of this great work. I, uh, in particular, would like to convey my special thanks to the former Minister of Agriculture uh, and Forestry, Mr. Vesel Eroğlu. I would like to uh, extend my special thanks to him on behalf of my nation, and I personally would like to thank to him very much. And I also would like to thank uh, to the contractor companies who took responsibility in that uh, process. I congratulate everyone involved in the project, uh, the engineers, the workers, everyone. Since we started uh, the construction of the process, uh, we have, uh, of course, all deserved uh, faced uh, many uh, handicaps in terms of uh, the credit uh, lines or uh, construction of it. But despite all, we uh, materialized this project. Terrorist organizations or financial institutions abroad and many others uh, tried their best to prevent us uh, from building uh, such a work. But I believe that they are all now Türkiye smashed uh, under uh, the gloriousness of uh, such a great work of art. This water dam uh, will be auspicious uh, for the region, for southeast Anatolia and the uh, cities uh, around, located in that area. And it's a beautiful day of celebration for all in the region. Uh, certain opposition parties, in particular uh, those extremists, uh, did indeed stand against the construction process uh, of this work. And I uh, wonder what uh, they will have to say after the project has been finalized. Because this uh, project will be of great use in terms of irrigation and uh, portable water in the region, uh, as well as uh, access to energy resources. We have everything uh, in that project. For the past 17 years, we have been practicing uh, much and uh, not only talk, uh, but uh, produce works, and this is a concrete example standing tall. There are people who do torture their own people, shed the blood of their own people, and this great work is the best response we have given to such people. Uh, the uh, wind of uh, brotherhood, uh, unison and peace uh, that will blow uh, from uh, the Ilissu uh, water dam, I believe, will be felt by everyone on these holy lands, I believe. Uh, the total energy generation of this uh, dam uh, will be uh, 4.1 billion kilowatts uh, hour, and uh, one out of the uh, total of six turbines uh, will be commissioned now. And every following month, we will be commissioning the other uh, turbines, and by the end of the year, the Lusu Water Dam will be fully operating. Uh, the cost of uh, Lusu Dam uh, will, uh, is, of course, uh, uh, of, uh, has uh, been of uh, about 18 billion dollars, considering all the other relevant work. Hassan Cave and some other regions, uh, certain other historical um, uh, areas and sites uh, have been protected meticulously during the construction. And only to protect to preserve uh, such uh, sites, we have allocated more than 250 uh, billion liras. And we expect uh, uh, that this project will contribute to the economy of our country overall by 2.5 uh, billion TL. The total uh, water uh, storage capacity of this dam will be 10.6 uh, billion uh, cubic meters. And this is, if you will, a valuable, a precious necklace on uh, the region uh, built on the river of Tigris. Uh, with its uh, total uh, installed power, this uh, project uh, will be the fourth uh, biggest water dam of our country. And in terms of the uh, filling uh, sand fill, it will be the second biggest. And Ulusu is going to be the number one uh, in the world in terms of its capacity, in terms of quality. The water to be stored uh, here will be released into the uh, Dijle water uh, dam, and we will uh, generate 1.1 uh, 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 billion 
kilowatts of uh, energy and will have a, a capacity to irrigate a large uh, agricultural uh, land. Now uh, I would like to ask what uh, the other people did uh, for the farmers. And uh, now we have built uh, that dam. We uh, know that uh, the uh, farmers living in the region will be at ease. Now, can you tell what it will do, this project, Mr. Kemal? Mardin, Sirt, uh, Batman-like provinces, uh, the surrounding cities, uh, will uh, benefit from it uh, tremendously, and I uh, wish that it will be auspicious uh, for all these people, for all these cities uh, located in the area. And I know uh, that the terrorist organizations will not be benefiting anyhow uh, from uh, that dam, because they had some other uh, motives uh, to use uh, over this uh, water dam. Many got lost in discussions of uh, political uh, concerns, but our nation, of course, uh, suffered a lot at the hands of these people. Eighteen years ago, when we decided to bring Turkey among the top uh, uh, of the world in terms of democracy and economy, of course, uh, some uh, people uh, thought that we could only be on in office for a couple of years and be well gone. But of course, we had done our plans accordingly. Uh, we had done our plans uh, for, a century, uh, for a half century, for a quarter century, and even a, a, a full century, and we have broken the vicious circle that the previous administrations could not. We said uh, education, health, uh, security, and justice. Those four pillars will be the pillars on which Turkey will rise upon. And we included uh, transportation, agriculture, and as well many other fields into the scope of all these activities uh, and built our strong uh, country accordingly. And our nation has shown uh, with their support that we have been on the right path. And uh, thank God, uh, in the past uh, 18 years, we did as much uh, as what was done uh, in a total of 48 years, and we did tenfolds or twentyfold uh, more than they could in uh, almost a 50-year uh, period. We also brought our economy to the top of, uh, levels of the world. Uh, education, health, uh, justice, and uh, security uh, were the uh, main elements on which our country uh, that, uh, and has uh, grown. Uh, and we have never, of course, ignored other fields. And you can see the examples of uh, all that work in many fields, including irrigation, agriculture. We have uh, built many facilities uh, in the past 17 years. In 2008, Turkey only had uh, 200, uh, some 200 water dams, and we additionally built uh, 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 built 500 more water dams uh, in the past 17 years. And in s a total uh, of 79 years, what did the previous administrations uh, actually build? Comparing the two, you can uh, clearly uh, see. But we should not uh, forget, you might have eyes, but you might not see. You might have a tongue, but you might not speak the truth. But you should be well assured that this nation sees clearly everything done. And uh, my uh, farmer brothers and sisters, of course, can clearly see the water dams uh, that we have uh, built. And Mr. Kemal, you will see uh, gradually, and the other uh, opponents, uh, they will see uh, what we have done. And the People's Alliance, of course, will be marching on its path, uh, tall and uh, sound and strong. We will inaugurate many other water dams uh, in the next uh, periods, maybe every month, uh, maybe uh, even in a short, uh, with shorter intervals, we will be inaugurating water dams, and this summer will be a period of richness in such areas. For us, in energy and water, we will grow. Uh, Turkey in 2007 uh, had only 79 hydroelectric power plants. 
and we have uh, brought in an additional 581 hydroelectric power plants. It means that Turkey has made a revolution uh, in terms of uh, energy and is one of the top countries of the world. In uh, 2000, uh, we had only 228 uh, irrigation lakes, but we uh, added uh, 385 more into the uh, scope. Turkey uh, irrigation uh, uh, wa portable water uh, facilities also were uh, of course much um, less in number uh, but we added more and more into the whole scope uh, of our capacity we uh, indeed uh, did grow our uh, production have made it more fr uh, fruitful and it er, has been reflected in many other uh, areas uh, of investment. Uh, other than the completed projects, we also have a lot of investment activities uh, currently uh, under uh, process. Uh, we have uh, commissioned many uh, facilities and we have plans to commission 403 new uh, facilities in the forthcoming period and it will uh, be contributing uh, to our energy uh, and economy uh, by 14 billion uh, liras and for portable water it will be bringing about 4.3 uh, cubic uh, million cubic meters of additional use and uh, we will be opening or uh, inaugurating these uh, facilities the uh, plants uh, gradually in the forthcoming periods. Of course, uh, we will never stop, uh, but will continue to march on our path, pursue our uh, journey and objectives, uh, produce day and night uh, for the sake of serving our people, our nation. Uh, therefore, the lockdowns uh, imposed in our country is uh, to curb, uh, to stem uh, the further spread of the uh, virus, not to slow down our uh, growth, I would like to remind once again. And uh, we uh, have uh, many sectors uh, who are active and operating in terms of basic needs, uh, and uh, they are exempt from the lockdown, the curfews imposed, and we have uh, declared the uh, title, the, their uh, details accordingly. And uh, we will have another four-day uh, lockdown uh, during the Ramadan Eid, and uh, we uh, also will allow our citizens uh, who have special works uh, to be able to work. Uh, the people who do uh, plant uh, roses in Esparta or uh, harvest tea in the Black Sea uh, region of our country and also many uh, other farmers and producers working in uh, all corners of the country. They will not uh, be uh, included into the scope of this uh, lockdown. They will uh, have a privilege and have a chance uh, to continue with the uh, uh, work and therefore we will work together we will work hard together to prepare for the new, new period new era uh, to come in particular i have to say uh, that we has to have uh, lost many during this coronavirus uh, pandemic uh, may uh, the mercy of god be on them and we have a lot who are uh, now being treated and i wish them a very quick recovery and we uh, also, uh, as you know, have been uh, opening new hospitals. One of those hospitals will uh, come operational in um, Bashakshehir region uh, on Thursday, and it will be called uh, the Bashakshehir Pine and Sagura Hospital. This hospital will have a capacity of 2,500 beds, and it will be a great attraction point. Uh, besides, in Yeshilköy, the district of Istanbul, we will have uh, another hospital. Uh, for emergency Dilmener. response. It uh, uh, will be Hastane named uh, uh, Professor Murat Dilmener Hospital. 
And on the same day, we will inaugurate another hospital. It will be uh, located, it is located in Hatemköy district of Istanbul, and it will be uh, called uh, Niazi, Professor Niazi, Kurtulmish Hospital. Uh, this uh, hospital was built by Sultan Abdul Hamid uh, for the soldiers of the time, but it was in ruins. But we have renovated this hospital uh, perfectly, uh, did the restoration activities accordingly, and named it after Dr. Istanbul, uh, Dr. Uh, Niazi Kurtulmuş, uh, Ismail evet. Niazi Kurtulmuş, and we will inaugurate this hospital uh, as well. Another hospital evet. is going to be inaugurated in Sanjak, the district of Istanbul, Feria Öz Emergency uh, Response Hospital. It Bin also oldu. has a capacity of a thousand Peki beds. And why have we done all of these? In particular, I would like to state uh, that these hospitals will represent us in the international arena and uh, shows that we have uh, converted our country, Turkey, into uh, an international healthcare center, if you will. In Sanjaktepe, as you know, we uh, previously had, a ho uh, had an airport built, and now people will uh, be able to land uh, and then uh, directly be able to go to the hospitals. This goes the same for Yeshilköy district because we uh, used to have a uh, uh, an airport located in Yeshilköy district and uh, the uh, runways there will uh, make it possible for people to land uh, through aircrafts and be able to go and visit those hospitals uh, directly. This will be possible also for Başakşehir Hospital. With all these uh, thoughts, uh, my uh, distinguished uh, people, I would like to uh, wish that uh, Lusu water them uh, will uh, hopefully be auspicious for the region, uh, for our country, for our people. I uh, once again would like to extend my special thanks uh, to uh, Professor uh, Erolu. Uh, I would like to thank to his team and all those who uh, work at the DG of State Hydraulic Works. I uh, once again uh, extend my special thanks to everyone involved in the project, engineers, workers, everyone, and I uh, hope that our citizens who will be uh, enjoying uh, this water dam uh, 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 will uh, be uh, at uh, further ease with the help of this uh, water dam, and I once again uh, wish uh, a holy and happy Laylatul Qadr, uh, Qadr night uh, to uh, all the Muslims uh, around the world. And I uh, hope uh, that uh, the Ramadan Eid will uh, bring about further peace, uh, further stability uh, to the world. And I uh, pray to God uh, that this uh, pandemic, this uh, outbreak, will uh, come to an end uh, before long. And I uh, would like to extend my love and respect to uh, everyone. Now we will be proceeding with uh, the inauguration of the first uh, turbine, the launching of the first turbine of the power plant. Efendim talimatınızla biz butona basacağız. Efendim talimatınızla biz butona basacağız. Şöyle fiziki mesafeye dikkat ederek Please make sure you pay attention to uh, physical distancing. Social distancing. Do not stand hand to hand uh, or very close to one another. Please uh, do pay attention. Be careful uh, about social distancing because I see that the people are very close to one another. And please make sure you give a mask to those who are not wearing one. Uh, Mr. Bekir, make sure you uh, deliver a mask to those colleagues who are not wearing uh, masks. We should be uh, taking our uh, measures, uh, taking our precautions first, so that we uh, would be able to ask our nation, our people, to do the same. I can see that people are standing very close to one another. We should be careful about social distancing. Maske, mesafe, 
temizlik. Bu Masks, şey çok önemli. Distancing Maske, and hygiene. Mesafe, these uh, these uh, three things are very important. We should be careful about wearing masks, evet. uh, social distancing, and uh, as well uh, as personal hygiene and cleaning. Şimdi All right, are we ready? Now uh, we ya can uh, push the buttons. Bismillah. Thank you. 